in a physical year for my company code SAP as we do it by using physical year variant what is a variant variant is nothing but a variable okay like a plus b is equal to c c means a plus b wherever i give c it indicates a plus b the same way financial years are defined in the variant and the variance have been declared by sap there are standard variants which reserve which release from sap k0 let's see <coughs> k1 i'll say k2 say k3 k4 okay so k0 means jan to december with zero special period this is declared from sap okay they have defined it let's see how it has been defined when you go to system k1 is jan to december with one special period this is two special period three special period four special period with jan to december with different special period we have a v3 april to march with four special period v6 july to june with four special period if you want to specifically define according to your requirement you can define your own physical year variance also or if it is your requirement is meeting any of the sap released variant you can just link this any of this variant to your company code whatever the company code we created jjj if you link so that company code will have this particular financial year as as for it okay so let me come back to the system and see where we do that can you explain a little bit of little bit come again spro transaction what is it is it manju or then yeah, spro transaction what you want to explain manju on spro transaction come again uh, no what do you, normally in spro that is the basic transaction for all these configurations is it see spro is a transaction where we do the customization so for example we created a company code okay that is a consultant we work on spro based on the configuration done in spro this easy access screen can be used by the users to do the day to day postings <coughs> so company code i set up i did it in spro now financial year i am setting it to a company code these are all a configuration part what we have to do okay as a consultant by understanding the client requirement so setting up things all will happen in the in the spro transaction like customization screen clear i'll come your financial accounting and then we go to the global settings because we are doing the base global settings then physical year here two steps one is maintain variant then assign variant so whatever we have seen the variant in the notepad i explained you can see those variant here and you can find some additional variants which our like we created by the people who are testing it so let's come and see our whatever the standard variants examples i have given let's come to k0 k1 k2 k3 k4 see here k0 k1 k2 k3 k4 k0 says it is a calendar day everything is been checked as a calendar year that means everything is checked as a calendar year that means jan to december all are jan to december okay here it says number of posting period 12 special period is 0 1 2 3 4 clear they are editable so we can change it is it they are editable you can change it you can you can change it but you cannot put more than 12 periods okay and special period only you can edit maximum to 4 other than that nothing addition or you can uncheck it okay you can uncheck it if you uncheck it it will not be a calendar year okay but as you check the year the calendar year system understand oh it runs as per calendar year january as first month february as second month and march as third month if you don't if you don't check that see we have v3 april to march how system will understand april as a first month march as second month with this wording it will not understand wording somehow sap will not do where it is been defined see here it is not been checked not been checked but you have a period number of posting period and the special period in some of the companies like air dependent is like it runs by weeks like 5 4 4 that means instead of end in in this case the month will not end by 38 it will end by weekends so first five weekends 
in the quarter first month will have five weeks second month will have four weeks and third month will have four weeks or you will have four four five like that it depends on some countries where it runs so for them it is year dependent that means every year the closing period of january will vary every year the closing period the closing day of the february will vary because based on the ending week it will vary that's the reason we call year dependent okay so anyhow uh, let's come to the v3 point where we are saying april to march in this case if you select your go to periods you can see the how v3 has been defined so the v3 is defined see 1 to 12 is the is the months okay and then i'll say every month day is 31 january february march april see january is 31 days 10 11 12 and here it is 1 april is the first month may as second posting period 9th 10th 11th 12th see here we are starting from april 1st okay december 31st okay and then i will have a year shift year shift is like now i am doing 2016 from january 1st it is 2017 but the financial year is 2016-17 so that there is an year shift that means when year is more forward so it is defined by minus one minus one minus one in the config clear <coughs> Clear, uh, Manju, Arshla, Dandu. Yes, no. If I select in V6, Arshla, is it clear? Dandu, clear? Yeah. Uh, just explain this uh, minus one thing once again. Yeah, minus one. See here, uh, let me take now another example, V6, which says uh, July to June, okay, where you can see July is the first month is the first month with 31 days okay so here it is showing zero that means current year if you consider july it starts 2016-17 financial year so july it will run okay next sixth period is done seventh period is one year is moving forward one year is moving forward that means did we say january 2017 but for us it is a 2016-17 with seventh posting period right so in that case Calendarly, the year has gone from 2016 to 2017. So that is the reason next Jan to June will have a one year shift. The same way next year 2017 it will start, 2018 January it will go. Clear. So when the financial year running between the between the years, between the years means like between the calendar years. So for the year shift as it go to next year, that months are indicated by minus one. Clear?